I'm Ashley Eskeva and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a pin so that when you buy things in the Google Play Store, you have to put in a pin before a purchase is approved. It's really important to have this set up because you don't want anybody buying anything via the Google Play Store without your permission. Let's take a look. First, we'll need to open the Google Play Store. From there, let's open our menu button and go to settings. And we see a bunch of different settings. We're going to scroll down to set or change pin. Now here, you have to create a pin in order to set it for purchases. So let's set up a pin. Now make sure you're not using 1234 or 0000. Once you set up your pin, you'll be asked to enter it one more time to confirm it. And now that you've had your pin set up, you'll see the option directly above it, use pin for purchases, is now available for you to check off. So let's check that box. And now from here on out, whenever you buy apps or other content via the Google Play Store, you'll be required to enter that pin as your information to make sure that you're the person buying the app and that you approve of that purchase. So whether you're looking to protect your phone from strange people who can access your Google Play account, or you just want to protect your account from your kids who might be buying some apps and different content that you don't necessarily approve of, setting up a pin for your Google Play Store account is an essential part of your Android phone setup. That's it for Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content, and we'll see you next time.